Hey guys, this is Elfmo J12, Wooden Dowel Tree. And triangle gift boxes. For the base of the tree, I cut scrap wood to be 7 and 1 4 of an inch by 3 and a half inches. The wood was 3 4 of an inch thick. Then I made an X in the center. I use a 5 8 of an inch by 48 inch dowel for the tree trunk. I use this 1 and a half inch wood screw to connect the base and tree trunk. With a 1 8 of an inch drill bit, I drilled a hole at the bottom of the dowel. I drilled it to be the length of the screw minus the thickness of the base. I taped the drill bit to know when to stop. Then I drilled a hole through the center of the base. Screw the base from the bottom up, then add a dowel to see if it fits. Then disassemble it. I mark the dowel with an X at 6 inches, 12 inches, 18 inches, and 24 inches. And cut the dowel at 28 inches. Then drill the holes. I started with a small drill bit and gradually worked my way up to the 3 of an inch drill bit. For the branches, I used 3 of an inch by 36 inch dowels. I probably should have used thinner ones so that I could have had smaller holes in the tree trunk. I marked them at 25 inches, 7 inches, 19 inches, and 13 inches. Then I cut them. I sanded them down so that they could fit through the holes. Next, assemble the tree. The holes I made weren't straight for my first attempt, so I made another one. The holes weren't completely straight, but it was a little better. I decided to stain it in the color dark walnut. I quickly wiped off the stain so that the pieces wouldn't turn out too dark. I'll eventually add a thin coat of polycrylate protective finish when the stain is completely dried. Add ornaments and your tree is done. I made templates for the gift boxes. Print and cut them out. Then fold the tabs. Flatten it and glue down the tabs to make a pouch. I added a scrap piece of paper inside so that the glue wouldn't stick to both sides. Next, fold the tab in half. Add it to the top and hole punch it. Put a note or treat in it and close the pouch with string. To 
make a triangle box, fold the tabs, and glue it together. But don't completely flatten the folded side. Make a little fold at the top to mark the sides. Then align the two sides and press it down at the top. Next, fold the tab. Add it to the top and hole punch it. Put something in it and close it up with string. And here's how it turned out. 